some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in New Britain, Connecticut, with the fraudster known as the Constitution State, as he attempts to, well, uh, film inside of the courthouse and make false accusations about what the police officers did to him in that courthouse. But, you know, his uh, attempts at uh, these false accusations fall flat on their face, considering that the cops actually have a bit more intelligence than he does. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and watch this frauditor make a complete and utter fool out of himself. What's up, everybody? It's Danny from the Constitution State here today. I hope everybody's having a good day. Today's video took place at the New Britain Courthouse, where they have some of the most ignorant marshals we've ever dealt with. I mean, it can't be, it's not just their fault because they're just listening to their criminal boss, O'Donovan Murphy. He seems to hate members of the press. He tells all his marshals that there's a judge's order on us and we're not allowed to bring our phones in the court. But the marshals have never seen it, yet they enforce it. Nobody can show it to me. I've been asking for it for a year and I can't get a copy of it. Huh, isn't that interesting? You've been looking for this uh, court order for about a year, but they won't show it to you, apparently. Uh, question. Have you tried, oh, I don't know, looking on the internet? Because these documents are readily available on their court websites. It took me less than five minutes of uh, using the Google machine to find them and make sure that they were indeed from the uh, New Britain Court District. So let me ask you something, Frauditor. Uh, what is your major malfunction? I mean, if it's that damn simple to get a hold of these documents, then what took you a year to even get to this point? I mean, come on now, dude. Are you somewhat lacking in the gray matter department? Uh, do you have deficiencies there? I mean, it's only understandable considering that you've got to have some real uh, gray matter deficiencies to become a frauditor. These guys love to come out and attack me, even though you're allowed to film in the court, you're allowed to record in the court. This is actually the court where we caught them lying. And, uh, let's see what happens. Yeah, just stand out there like Jason Voorhees, uh, pointing your camera inside. Uh, yeah, that's not going to draw any attention to yourself. Well, I don't know what they're pointing at. You know, I have to record right here. I don't know if we'll be able to see on camera. He's in there waving his hands, trying to tell me I gotta go. I don't gotta go. Oh, they're calling somebody. What? I absolutely can. Look at the rules. Look what the rules say. What are the rules say? Can you not pull that on me? Move your foot. Can you not pull that on me? I'm allowed to be here. Move your foot. I'm allowed to be here and I'm allowed to record. Move your foot, please. What are the rules to the court say? Move your foot. What are the rules to the court say? What are the rules to the court say? You can't record in here. Yes, they can. Absolutely. No, you can't. Why not? Record in the courthouse. That, yes, a, you can. You can't record in the courtroom. Watch your. Yeah, dude, you may want to rethink uh, this whole thing because in this one right here, it says courthouse, basically meaning the whole building. So, dude, uh, why don't you take some uh, classes in reading comprehension or something like that? Or is it uh, just you, like many other frauditors, tend to have? a reading comprehension issue, which leads me to suspect that many of you have a certain set of learning disabilities. The, where the, the get the rules. Because I just had you. another court earlier today bring the rules out. Watch your foot. And we're allowed to. Watch so you guys are going to violate my rights. Excuse your foot. You guys are going to violate my rights. Watch your foot. Are you going to violate my rights? I'm not violating Yes, nothing. you are. I'm just telling you, you can't record it. But I can. You're impeding I, the entryway. No, I'm impeding who's here. You're Who am I impeding? There has to be traffic. Well, you moron, you are essentially uh, blocking an entrance into a courthouse, potentially uh, impeding people's entry into this uh, establishment that might actually have 
legitimate business here. Not the uh, people like you who just want to cause problems because they have no job. There has to be traffic. The school you foot. There has to be. You guys have We're jurisdiction in the building. There is no game. You guys should be doing your job. I'm asking you nicely. Why don't you guys just do your job? Just move your foot up. We are doing our Why don't you let me do my job? This is not your job. Your job has nothing to do with harassing the citizens. Just doing nothing foot, wrong. Watch your foot. Why? Your foot, Why can't I be here? Watch. Where's your boss? Watch your get foot. Get your boss, please. Supervisor, just your watch your foot. Can you get the supervisor? You're not gonna violate my rights in the process. When you get, when he comes up, you can, you can talk. Why about can't I just do what I'm doing? You gotta move your foot so you can watch the door. Why can't I just do what I'm doing? Here's, here's a lieutenant. You can talk. Okay. To him. You know you can't record on girls. Yes, you can. No, you can't. Yes, where are the rules? Can you get the rules? Because I know the rules state you can. You can. So you're gonna lie to my face? Because I have the rules. I've seen them. I got them from the, your boss. I uh, know, dude. That's you. And so far, I've managed to point out several of your lies. So. I think what you're doing right here is nothing but projection. Which states you can. You absolutely can. When you show them to us. I don't have to show you the rules. You got to show me the rules. But we got to show them. No, you got to show me the rules. Why do I got to show you anything? This is stuff you guys should know. How much do you guys make a year between the three of you? Watch your foot. How much do you guys make between the three of you? Watch your foot. Can you please not rub up on me in some homosexual way? Watch your foot, I said. Is you guys going to watch him just rub up on me and sexually assault me? Watch your foot. You guys are pathetic, man. Have fun, you bunch of queers. Every one of you do it. Bunch of sallies. Wah, wah. This is what they do. Bunch of liars. Every one of them a fucking liar. Wah, wah. Dude, you're a grown-ass man. Quit acting like this. Isn't he wonder why you're a jobless moron? Bunch of losers. And then they'll lie. Be careful, they're a bunch of liars. Watch out for them, bunch of full grown men that lie. Bunch of sallies. Feel tough? Huh? Feel tough? Pushing around, making up your own laws. There ain't no fucking rule that says you can't record in there. And each and every one of you dummies will sit there and repeat it. It ain't true. Oh, you gotta show me the rules. I'm gonna bring them back. Why don't you guys get back to work? And and now this whiny little butt hurt frauditor is going to call the police on these officers for doing their job of keeping him out. I mean, the rules are quite clear. They're listed on the uh, Connecticut uh, judicial websites. I mean, it, they're easy to find. You just got to have somewhat of a uh, functional brain to be able to look them up. And uh, once you find them, they're easy to read. Oh, because you guys don't actually work. This is what you do. How'd you guys get promoted? You don't even know the basic rules to the court. You guys are that dumb. That dumb. I just make up whatever I want. So what happens when you wear a costume. Be careful, they'll lie and they will arrest you and they will hurt you. Be careful, they're dangerous. Each and every one of them is a fucking liar. They will hurt you, be careful. Be careful. That dude sexually assaulted me. He rubbed his ass all over my so what you guys do? Over nothing? Over a made-up rule that you made up? You grind people? That's what they taught you in the academy? Oh, when, they, when you make something up and they don't listen, just rub your ass on them. You're pathetic, bro. You are pathetic. And this is what he does for the next 20 minutes as he whines, cries, and complains like this. And, well, the, when the police finally show up, he's a bit more respectful to the responding officers. But does it really go anywhere? Let's just go ahead and skip to that part and find out. Many, many minutes later. I mean, so the chief, the chief marshal came uh, just to show us the video. So we watched the video. There's a couple of cameras on the outside there. Um, this is... Doesn't seem like there's much there. Like what? In 
terms of like the, the, the like you said, he rubbed up on you. I mean, yeah. we watched we watched the video. Like he turns into you to like push, the, kind of close the door. But there's, but watching on video, there's nothing that shows like he's like. I got my video. I'm saying I know. I understand that, dude. I'm saying there's a court video. We just watched it. That's pointing down. Okay. Yeah. Well. Court. Okay. So that, I'm not even. I don't even care about that though. Okay. Really. Um. Oh, well, now that there's uh, actual video evidence that you're lying to this officer, uh, you don't care about it all of a sudden. Yeah, you've been caught red-handed, and you're like, nope, nope, nope uh, let's just change the subject. Yeah, typical for auditor. But do they know that we're allowed to record outside the court? No, That's really right so outside the court. But the, 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 the issue at hand is that you're opening the door and recording. Once you open that threshold, because again, we said to them and they said this to us, they don't care if you want to stand outside and wear that garbage can and film the outside of the courthouse for 12 hours, that's your prerogative. When you open the door and you film inside the courthouse, our understanding is per the court, per the judge, their policy is that they don't allow a recording and you oh, specifically have been told, listen dude, I'm just telling you what the, for, for so, the so, so how are we going to look into it then? Because obviously somebody's lying here. They're lying. The rules are right there inside the court. I see them every time I go in there. You know, you're right. It's clear that there's somebody lying in this, uh, little incident right here uh but it's not them it's you i mean if you look at the uh websites that the uh courts have you can see it plain as day on there now with you uh, it's either you're a liar or you have a reading comprehension problem because well if you uh have a reading comprehension problem and you're yeah, that you were special needs or something like that then it would be understandable but if not, then you're just a flat out liar. Were you ever given like a certified no, letter that never, you can't never, you can't have never, like a recording device? Never. Never? Never. Okay. <laughs> never. They say there's one, but they can't provide it. They've never provided it and, and I'm not even fighting. Them. But that's inside court. Yeah. And, and I'm not inside court. But once you open the door you're and your camera's inside the court. No, I didn't my camera didn't go inside the court. You, I dude you it's on the camera, that's what I'm saying. I held my camera in the court? Yeah. Let's see what happens. You had your camera inside the door, so once you open the door, you're inside the threshold of the court. That's considered once you open the but door. But yeah, but so where's the order though? If you gotta see the order, if you're gonna stand up for them, where's the order? You were given the policy. No, no? I was not, no. I was never given anything, that's what I'm saying. They say there's something, they've never given me anything stating I can't do this. Well, you told me you've been to court a million times. Yeah, I have been, and, and they, they take never... my phone every time, but yeah. they've never shown me this order. They can't, I foia it for a year, yeah. they can't give it to me. Okay. And, and like I said, the kid got arrested here last year for the same thing, and then yeah. went to court for it, and everything had to get thrown out because there was no thing. They lied. That's what I, they're making this up. It's made up, 100%. And okay. if they can show me a thing, that's fine, but they can't. Okay. And, and, and that's where the problem lies, is they're just doing whatever they want. Like I told him, they, they, they've told me they've never even I'll seen this order. Every these Marshall, uh, Danielson, Putnam, all of them have admitted, Norwich has admitted to never seeing the order. I've never even seen it. So how are you enforcing it if you've never even seen it? And they can't provide it. So when I come to court next time, and whatever, whenever I gotta come back, and I come here and they can't provide it, and, and I, I'm gonna call you guys, and you guys are gonna show up, and if they don't have an order, you're gonna get me in with my phone? So the security of the court is not really our. That's no, like, but that that's yes, it is. No, you guys are the state police. You guys have jurisdiction state. over all these guys for criminal stuff. Yeah, that's it's, a criminal it's, matter. It's, it's they're a, stealing my property. They're, it's, no, they're stealing my property. If I don't want to give my property over, you're stealing my property, literally. No, that's what it is. There's no twisting okay. it. Right. it. It is. They're stealing my property. Okay. And that's just they can't do that. Okay. So basically, what you're saying is. You didn't do anything. You just like so they think they can do that. Well, again, I can open were... the door and record. I know I can. I'm gonna keep doing it. Like I, I, I'm not walking in the court. I'm not in court. And you, you guys didn't even look into the rules that state you can record. I could bring it up on my phone right now. There's no policy. The rules say you can record everywhere but the courtroom. Everywhere. Then why don't you bring it up? Because I've shown it on my uh, video already where you can't do that. So uh, if you have what you say you have, then show it. Otherwise, you don't know it and you are practically or outright lying to these officers. 
Okay. Again, the information that we're given from the chief marshal was that you were told you can't bring recording devices in to the courthouse. You can't record inside the courthouse. You can't bring them inside the courthouse. Once you open, once you cross the threshold, you're inside the courthouse. Then. Okay, so as long as I don't cross, I can open the door. I just can't cross that threshold. No, you're recording because you're recording the inside of the courthouse. I'm allowed to. I can go stand by all these windows and record in. I just yeah, did it earlier today. I, I know because you're outside. That's what I'm saying. Like when you stand the in same the thing. In the doorway. It's the same thing. I really expected that. Uh, all right, thank you guys. You know what it's time for? It's time for this frauditor's walk of shame. He tried to manipulate everybody. He tried to lie to everybody. And uh, he ended up falling flat on his face. So here you go. Here's your walk of shame, frauditor. Enjoy it. And that's where the video ends. He only gave a couple seconds of his original walk of shame, so I had to slow it down to tw one quarter speed just to get that much without it looking like a complete mess. But at any rate, uh, yeah, I have a feeling that this is just one complaint that's just never going to be listened to because, well, you do have cameras in the courthouse that do record everything, and it they showed that this guy was, well, completely lying. But what else do you expect from a frauditor anyway? All they ever do is come up with new lies every day to try to make the uh, actual police that are not the uh, corrupt ones look bad. And unfortunately for this douchebag, it uh, really, really blew up in his face. So congratulations, uh, the Constitution State. You are a gibbering, idiotic moron. So at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks uh, for watching, and I will see you on the next one. You don't want to go to jail. For what? You read this. Yeah. I don't have to listen read to anything. Blah, 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 blah. I'm not listening. Gosh. I'm not. No. Blah, 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 blah. Blah 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 blah. You suck. They think they know it all. What's the Third Amendment, punk? Tell me the Third Amendment and I'll leave. What's the Third Amendment? What's the Third Amendment and I'll fucking leave right now? What's the Third Amendment? Tell me. What's the Third Amendment? Most definitely, because you don't understand why I'm here with a camera. Doesn't mean I have to get out of here. Doesn't mean I have to leave. Doesn't mean I have to go. <clears throat> that sort of thing. Well, this is what we're gonna do. Um, we're going to have to enforce the, the CT and have you leave the property. Um, per the postmaster, per the lead, uh, per the um, the uh, the person, the landlord of this uh, facility. Uh, so with that said, um, I've got too many entities I know. You gave me a warning to get off the property. I got off the property. I need your name No, sir. You're either going to provide or you're going to I'm going to remain silent, sir. Okay. You want my name and date of birth? Put your hands right now. He chose poorly. Morning, Deputy Regan St. John's County Sheriff's Office. Two reasons I'm stopping you. One, Pine Island speed limit's 25. You're going 36. Okay. That's still 10 miles per hour over the posted speed limit. It's 25. No, it's not 25? So, I was going at 35. Also. So that's 10 over. You just told me that you're going 10 over the supposed speed limit. Oh, no, I didn't tell it, you that. Yes, you did. You said you're going 35, right? Yeah, but I said... That's a 25. 25. No, ma'am. It's it. The whole thing's 25. Okay. The other issue is your license plate cover is illegal. You can't have a tinted license plate cover over your license plate. Hi, how are you? Okay, I'm doing good. Well, you're detained right now. You're not free to leave, okay? Just, Why? I've been calling after you. You know you're not to be on campus. No. Put the phone down. She yes. asked me to leave and I left. No, ma'am. So you, you guys... You are now under arrest. You guys are arresting me for nothing. No. You know you've been arrested for this before. Dumbass! <laughs>
You dumbass. You're a dumbass. Such a dumbass. You're an ass. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's... Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that? You know why you're kicking me out? Because you don't want what, someone watching a movie in the courthouse. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I know some of y'all are disappointed. I'm disappointed. Um, I hope that you will continue to watch this channel because this channel has brought more good than negativity.